don't leave the layouts all willy-nilly where any delivery person could see them. I'm sorry. I was, I was just trying to get them organized. Where magazines? Magazines. I distinctly remember asking someone to buy this month's issue of French Couture. That was Maxie. That was Maxie, and she's well, in New York, so Lula, she this is your opportunity to step up. I sincerely hope that Mr. Spinelli is not here to fix some sort of computer error that you failed to mention. No, the Jekyll is uh, here to fall upon your combined tender mercies to release uh, possibly privileged information about the fair Maximista. Such as? When can I anticipate her wondrous return? Uh, not for a few days. I sent her to a photo shoot in Manhattan. Mm -hmm. This is a good opportunity. See, if you excel at something, anything, you will be rewarded too, the <coughs> Well, I'm sorry. I just failed to see what Maxie did that was so glorious. Well, she has her way with the artist. Creative people are quirky. She seems to understand their way of thinking. That's why she was able to develop a rapport with Federico Cabrero so quickly. Oh, who? Federico Cabrero. He is this fabulous young designer who has the entire world at his feet. No, it's actually a real coup for Crimson that he's taken such a shine to Maxie. I intend to do whatever I can to further that relationship. Yeah, how bright of a shine? She's staying in his loft. Oh, Mr. Spinelli, don't despair. Perhaps, perhaps we can utilize your cyber skills for a mutual satisfaction. I mean, after all, knowledge is ammunition, right? Why don't you jackal him? Well, that's the correct terminology, isn't it? All right, see what you can find to further our respective goals. I mean, unless you're busy with Sunny. I, I, I regret to say that Mr. Corinthus has fallen a bit off the radar. I fear that knowing the identity of little Michael Shooter hasn't brought as much satisfaction as he may have hoped. What are you itching so we can't scratch, man? Um, Jackal requires a cold one, please. Well, would the Jackal prefer a uh, glass, bottle, or a tap? I don't know. Orange soda, it's in a bottle, right? Yeah, yeah, orange soda's in a bottle. I'm just trying to follow in the footsteps of the master. That's all. Mm -hmm. you know, so far, all you're doing is you're, you know, you're looking like kind of like a fool. Oh, yeah, it was okay. I mean, so what? I mean, what? What exactly you have? Come on, shake magnet coolness. Right. Have you have you ever noticed the caliber? of moths that flicker to Stone Cold's flame? I mean, like a goddess Samantha, okay? Daughter of darkness Claudia Zakara. Even, even a married Valkyrie stays in Stone Cold's sway. And if I don't find a way to assimilate to a similar prowess, my, my tempestuous love will fly into the arms of a runaway Romeo and be lost forever, so... Well, look, I'm not your master, but... I've been chasing tails since I was 14, so I could probably enlighten you on a few things. I would be really grateful for your worldly wisdom. <laughs> All right. 
first. Yes. No, whoa, whoa, what? Orange soda's got to go, brother. Okay? Oh, no, no, hey, it's not wine. You don't sniff it. You don't sip it. You knock it back. I'm the man. Check it out. Come on, Hatch. Come on, like a sexy man. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> hold it. No, hold it. Right. You can't do that. Here. No, you're all right. Put your hand up. You're all right. Go right here. There you go. You got it. You got it. Yeah. Now, the thing about Morgan and women that's key is uh, he doesn't try. Okay? And he lets them talk. Okay? And the chicks love that man. Right? And hey, 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 the great thing is, any guy can master it. Even you. I know you do sit there and shut up, right? Huh? <laughs> yeah. Another player? <laughs> okay. And this head does all right. Right here. Oh, come on, now. Hey, um, your timing is most opportune in light one. Um, might, might the jackal buy you a tasty beverage in exchange for some light alternate advice? <laughs> now, women respond faster when they think you're confident without arrogance. Confidence isn't... Really, the jackal's strong suit. Oh, well, that's something you can work on. Yeah. Now, what not to do? <clears throat> never talk about a past relationship, good or bad. You'll never live it down. And even if you think your woman's mother is the hottest thing you've ever seen in a pair of boots, never admit it. Ever. Pretend you're blind. Come on. I've seen you in action, man. You got matches all over town for days. Give it up for the kid. No, that was a BP. Sorry, BP. Before pregnancy, and that's the big danger, little buddy. Women eventually respond, and sooner or later, you're going to crash into one that wants a kid. One careless night, and bam! Racking up notches is a thing of the past, and your future is nothing but baby. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> 